How you doing, sir? John McClellan. Porter Manley. All right, with open the air university. All right, sir, I'm with Open Air Outreach. Okay. Yeah, we're here to exercise our freedom of speech li uh, rights and freedom of religion. We understand this is a public campus. That's all we want. We're not here to solicit anything. We're just here to exercise our freedom of speech and our just freedom of religion. Just a second. Okay. Hey, sir. Yeah. Uh, I'm you're not fooling anybody, friends. Thank you. Yes, please. Everywhere I go, I see the kind of people yes, sir. I Everybody that uh, uses campus property has to register their event through our office. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you all aren't uh, registered to be here now. So you'll have to pack up and leave. Are you saying this is a public campus? Is that true? That's correct, sir. And the, is but every event is, is uh, registered on this, you know, for uh, any I believe you, sir. I, I believe you. And but as I understand, this is a, a public campus. We have a the Constitution guarantees us a right of freedom of speech. Now, if you're telling us to, to pack up our banner, okay, but we still want to speak to people. That's all we're doing, we're just speaking to people. This is a public expression. We have a lot of uh, uh, religious groups that come out here and do public expression, like the Gideons and stuff. Okay. But we have uh, policies to bring people out. Now, this guy's preaching rather loudly out here. Right. And we're having events out here, so this is, okay. this is not sit, sitting right with what we do out here. Okay, you need to register, and we rent. How long does we, that take? Is there a time period? So I'll register for it right now if I can. Well, it won't happen today. I mean, we have to do a contract. You have to be an organization. You have to have insurance. It'll cost you money to come out here. So we have to have all these parameters met in order to speak freely on this campus, sir? Is that what you're telling me? Pretty much. I mean, that, that's uh, a constrainment of our freedom of speech. That's all. We're not here to interfere. We're here to preach the gospel. We're, we're here to to teach people about Jesus this Christ. This is an academic uh, I agree, campus, sir. And right now you're causing a... a, a, a this is a crowd gathering to hear this free speech. There's nothing yeah, wrong with that. They can leave if they like. We're not but, but making them stay. It's, 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 it's upsetting some people. I go, to maybe, church. I go to church, sir. Maybe, but, but Jesus said the gospel will upset some people, won't it? We call people out and we tell, tell them about sin and righteousness and judgment to come. People get upset. We start talking about immodesty and start calling out sin like homosexuality, those things that God is against. Well, of course, sir. It's going to happen that way. People will get upset. But that's what the free marketplace of ideas is. That's what university means, sir. You know that. I know that. But, okay. uh, again, we, we haven't had... Uh, we we uh, put events out here. Sure. And, We're, uh, you know, these the people stopping and not interfering with those events. We're just out here to exercise our freedom of speech. They can walk uh, about if they like. We're not stopping them. We're not trying to sell anything to them. We're just trying to exercise our freedom of speech. I'll tell you what, uh, my office is in the Wheelwright Auditorium, okay. which is over there. Okay. You need to you need to pack up your stuff, and you can come over and talk to me about registering your event correctly. Okay? Hey, well, I believe what you're telling me is unconstitutional. I object to it, and uh, sir, I, excuse me, sir. I'm sorry. I object to it. My organization objects to it. Well, then I'm going to have uh, law enforcement come out here. Okay. Well, I thought we could talk about this, sir. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just registering my objection with you. That's all I'm doing is registering an objection with you. I'm you, trying to read this out with you. It's, it's the wrong, uh, I'm the wrong person to re does, register. Does the Constitution it? guarantee us a freedom of speech and a freedom of religion? It does. does. That okay, but is this does. a state public campus? Yes, it does. It is, okay. And state property is supported by the taxpayers, of which I am, like 35 years now. I'm almost 50 years old. I'm, I'm not junior walking by here. Not 
not all of this campus is, is uh, publicly supported. The students pay tuitions. And, uh, uh, that's great, but they couldn't be here on that tuition they're here on without our tax support. Is that correct? All these buildings couldn't be built without our tax support. And we're just asking to, for a favor with you and the administration to let us continue, let the students interact with us. Some will get angry, and that's fine with us. We're not concerned about that. We appreciate. I'm, con I'm concerned about uh, we, we appreciate you making people angry out here on a, on a in an academic atmosphere. You don't catch anybody else out here, you know, doing that. There's a time and a place for this kind of uh, like in a church building or something, or. Yeah. We have churches. We have we have churches meet out here. They rent our facilities. We have Gideons come out here. We have a lot of stuff like that. But you're 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 teaching out here, okay? There's academic things going on around here. Are we interfering with that? Well, apparently, yeah. Well, they're just standing around and they're just listening to the freedom of speech. That's all we're doing. That's all we're doing, sir. That's, that's all we're asking for favor to do that. The 60s and 70s were were a, a great time of change and revolution in the United States, and the freedom of speech was. You called them, sir. Captain, how you doing, John McClellan? Hey. How are you, sir? My name is John McClellan. John? Uh, yes, sir. I'm here in charge of this event, Sergeant. Okay. Yeah. Uh, who gave you authorization to be on? Well, we believe the Constitution gives us that authorization, okay. sir. Well, you, this is you, private property. You can, this uh, is public property, sir. No, sir this is private the property. The dean here has just informed not us. Not the dean. He's not well, the dean. I'm it's in private property. It's 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 private held property. in trust for the state by the Board of uh -huh. Trustees of this uh -huh. university. What's without your name, sir? Permission or without an invitation from somebody on this university, you do not have the right well, to. Well, the meet. website of this campus says it's a it's, excuse it's me, it's public, public university. That right. means that anybody right. and can a public attend university. it once they're registered. It doesn't mean it's public property. Now, we're going to leave, but we, un we want to make sure we understand each other, Major, that uh, we have a constitutional right to be here. That constitutional right is being violated by, by the administration or you asking us to leave. We have every right by the Constitution of South Carolina and the federal constitution to express our freedom of speech and to uh, to hand out literature as freedom right. of the press when and you start freedom of religion. Class, when you start disrupting students, start disrupting people, uh -huh. you, you cross that line. You understand that? Uh, well, we... You see all these people coming out here? Yeah, that's this good. This is a disruption that's of our good. classes, okay? That's so you good. Need to get your stuff and get out now. We're going to be obedient to that, sir. Okay. Right now. Yeah, we're going to be... See you. Yes, sir. We're we'll obeying, obeying that right now. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Come on, Jesse, we got to leave, man. Pack up your banner. We already talked about it. they tell you what law, then? Yeah, they say it's a private campus, so we'll deal with that. Did they take tax dollars to pay for it? Uh, yes. Their salaries and their salaries, and that's fine. Yeah, we're going. Thank you, Major. Well, not that way. I'm the driver on that way. I'm not going to walk your campus. Uh, is, is there any public... Uh, Public streets that that go through this campus, sir. You need to leave. Okay, I've already asked you. I'm just you asking time. a question. I'm asking you a second. I'm just time. asking a question. What's just asking a question. Campus? Coastal Carolina University. Coastal Carolina. Yeah. Not didn't say state in there. No. Okay. But it's a state university for sure. It's not public. We'll be back. Shaking off the dust. Wait, are you saying this is a private university? I understand that there's governors or administrators who manage the property, but that doesn't make it private if it's publicly funded. Every state is a very is it a permit process? Is there a waiting period for that permit? Sorry? Is there a waiting period for that permit? Yes. Okay. Now, so we can go fill one out right now and preach today? No. Is there a difference between this campus and a state campus that you know of? Like, like a state university? Is there a difference between that and this? No. Tom, they've already threatened to sue us and everything, so I don't think... I didn't no, threaten to sue anybody. It's a no. warning. It's, not threatening it's, anybody. A, it's a caution. We don't want... We just want to exercise our freedom of speech. That's all we want to do. That, no, you're not. You're escorting us off the campus. We have the freedom to be here and express ourselves.
start disrupting classes and people and students? Well, of course, when the students gather around, they want to listen. That that might seem to you be disruptive, but but it's not disruptive. They were they were very quiet. They're very cordial. You want to see disruptive? Come down to Daytona Beach. That's disruptive. 